Hey y'all, Brandon Bergeron with Survivor Mindset Day Number Nine. I uh, just recently finished contacting all of our athletes yesterday, um, all 90 plus, and connecting with them. And generally, it seems like people are staying busy. Um, they're always really encouraging, and uh, just trying to get a scope of uh, how people are impacted and, um, you know what this is doing for uh, their homes and what their outlook is. And of course, you know, everybody's kind of like answerless and, um, but relatively, you know, positive and uh, they want to continue to support the gym um, and my efforts to uh, provide motivation and, you know, different challenges for the day. Um, it was an overwhelming amount of support and it's really helped me to define what success is to me on a whole nother level. Um, I create all these different metrics, um, as far as what a, uh, you know, successful business should look like. Um, but one of the things that I tend to forget about sometimes and place less value on is how people are you know, genuinely feeling part of a community and want to extend um, their ability to be able to help in any way that they can. Um, and you don't really know those things until we have experiences like what we're experiencing now. Um, you know, no one can uh, anticipate a pandemic. So um, the fact that we're in this situation and we are... Um, essentially seeing what types of things are um, coming out of the the, um, the truth that is embedded within ourselves um, you know in other words what people want to be part of even though our regular home um, of you know, training resources are being compromised. Um, it's just cool to see how much support that people want to put in. And so, yeah, that is a huge metric that I'm going to continue to pursue um, when I define success. And I think that it should be applied to all things, you know, all different disciplines and areas of our life. And uh, it's exciting because it helps me to put a different focus and a different spin on how I measure the success of this growing business. And when we are back open and we're in our recovery phase, um, that's going to be a way that I measure um, and evaluate how successful we are. So think about that. And you can, this can be applied to all different areas of, of your life. And that's going to look different for everybody. But the fact is, we need each other, um, and we are social animals, and even if we are good at separating ourselves from um, communities, um, most of us thrive on, you know, interactions and that kind of thing, and um, growing relationships. So, let me know if you have any thoughts, um, but I hope that shines a little bit of light into the most important things in life. All right, love you guys.